that's my hair dried now after the treatment so I've got quite a blonde chunk there so I'm going to pre-pigment that with a bright red just in a semi-permanent I'm using a Revlon colour a Nutri Colour Cream in purple red just so it keeps it vibrant and it doesn't look wishy-washy so here we go goodbye blonde so I've sectioned off the blonde goodbye blonde I wish I had the Bullockos to keep it this colour. Flattering our angles doing this, I do apologise. Oh, I dreaded watching the playback. What with the lighting being atrocious and the face pulling. Ooh, ooh, ooh. piece of hair, the hair that I pre-pigmented, which is bleach underneath, 
people seem to forget that if they've bleached their hair then dyed it back to brown they suddenly think it's got the strength of brown hair again natural brown hair but it hasn't so what I'm going to do I'm going to uh, mix some water in with the colour and just put it on for the last 10 minutes because it's extremely porous it, it doesn't need full strength peroxide to make it work so I'll be back when I've done that <laughs> a pink stripe I'd love to go pink all over just worry about being too old quite frankly plus I haven't got the balls so let's just see don't step into the light I just want to get into the light should be in the light very little sunlight here in the UK as it's spring Summer, rather, it's May. No bloody light as usual. Oh, pardon my friend. Yep. That's it, I'm pleased with it. Thanks for watching.